Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Urbanonix72, and today I'm going to be giving you guys a tutorial on how to download and install the Zombies 1.7.3 Flying Mod Pack for Minecraft. And um, this is, should work on single player and multiplayer, and depending on what server you use, um, depends on whether it will work or not. Some servers allow it, some don't, so contact an admin, or if you're the admin, you should probably know that information off the top of your head. So what I'm going to do first, guys, is um, I'm going to go ahead and copy this link that I have handily prepared. Um, I'll have all this in the description so you guys can uh, access it easily and quickly, and you guys don't have to fart around and find it. So I'm going to go ahead, Command C, copy. I'm going to go into my browser, and I'm going to paste it in. And after it's in, I'm going to it's going to take me to this. My ad block's on, so it's going to just be it's blank um, on yours if you don't have ad block. It might look different. It's okay. Once skip ad pops up, push skip ad. And what you're going to see is you're going to see this. Zombies mod pack, MC beta 1.7.3.zip. So you know it's the right one. And open with archive utility. Make sure it's like that. See that pop up in the bottom right. And then it's going to be uh, done. Downloads complete. So we can go ahead and we can uh, quit the browser. And um, I've already done this a few times. And um, I, uh, I deleted all my stuff and redownloaded Minecraft. So it's all working properly. Uh, so you guys don't have to worry about that. Um, I have Zombies Mod Pack, the zip folder right here. I'm going to go ahead and open that. Um, but first, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take this right here, line, uh, this text line, and I'm going to go ahead and copy that. And then I'm going to uh, go ahead and open Terminal. Um, you can search it in Searchlight for here if you haven't already, or if it's not on your dock. It should be in Utilities under Applications near the bottom. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste that in. And that should pop up. Should be your name. There should be MCTMP, which means the file is created, and then your uh, general username again. And then uh, we'll leave this open, actually. Um, and then what we want to do is we're going to go into Finder, and I'm going to make a new window, which is Command N. And we're going to go ahead. Um, it should be on your name right here. So Harrison Vargo is my name. You guys just learned the biggest secret about me. Oh, my gosh. Drop dead, people, drop dead. And you're going to search MCTMP. Uh, and there should be this folder right here. And it's going to be uh, chocked full of a bunch of little Java classes and uh, Java, JavaScript files. Um, so, uh, you know, it's the right one. 697 items sh it should properly have. And this should contain basically all the general stuff for your Minecraft. Don't go deleting any of this. Now what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and go into the Zombies Mod Pack zip that you unarchived, and you're going to go to Classes. You're going to take these 21 classes, push 1, Command A, highlights them all, Command C, copies them. You're going to go into this, just click anywhere, and push Command V for paste in. And you're going to get this little message, and it's going to uh, ask you, do you want to replace this all um, with the one you're moving, blah, blah, blah. Um, push Apply to Wall and push uh, or click replace and uh, you're done with this so I'm gonna go ahead and just hop on back over there now what you want to do is you want to go and um, copy down this text line which again will be in the description command C and then you're going to go into terminal again and you're going to paste it in and this is getting rid of the um, MCTMP folder so you can check it by going into Finder again and type in MCTMP. After an awkward silence, you should probably figure out that it's not there any longer. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. You're a genius. <laughs> and then what you're going to want to do is uh, actually you're done with this info now, so you can go ahead and cancel out of that. Now what you want to do is you want to go to your name here, library, application support, and scroll down till you find the one so awesomely dubbed Minecraft. Now what you're going to want to do is uh, see all this stuff here. You can click anywhere and or right click and hit new folder. You're going to want to type or name this folder mods and please don't spell it differently, don't put caps in there, this is not going to work properly. So once mods is in there you're going to go into that folder and create another folder inside that one and name this one zombie, Z-O-M-B-E. Don't spell it wrong or you're screwed. Once you're good open that one up. And now what you're going to want to do is, uh, my bad, you can close out of uh, terminal. 
um, you're going to want to go back into the zombies mod pack and go to config and there's going to be 13 items and you're going to want to again command A highlight them all and command C copy them now you're going to want to go into the zombies folder and you're going to want to push command V and then they're all going to be in here now you guys you can cancel or close out of this folder now to turn on your mod you simply need to double click config doc text so this is the configurations for all the mods and now you're going to see all this to basically find the fly mod which most of you are probably looking for um, just do command F which is find and type in fly mod and go ahead and push next alright it's not working okay scroll down for a bit I'm not gonna do this commentary all over again because I don't like doing commentaries over again you hear it? Don't like it. So you're gonna find this one. And it's gonna be uh, fly mod, aka flying. You're gonna go here, and you're gonna find the little uh, hashtag pound sign right on the same line as yes to enable. Please delete hashtag. You're good to go. And now you can mess around with the keys. Make sure they're capitals. If they're lowercase, they don't work. F enables the um, the fly mod, so you might have to toggle some controls on Minecraft. E goes up. Q goes down. Left shift um, is a modifier, so it's like holding down sprint on Call of Duty. You know, it enhances your speed, it makes you go faster. My favorite settings for these, these are the best ones I personally believe because it can be slow or too fast if you mess with them. Uh, do the running speed multiplier over here as 2.3. This one, the next one as 0.4. This one over here, do that one just to 2.0. And then you're going to, want to <clears throat> save or you're gonna have to do it again and then you can push quit uh, make sure you don't just push the little X in the corner because uh, down here you want uh, text edit to be gone and now you can close out of that and you can go ahead and open up Minecraft Minecraft should launch normally and if you're using a torrented version um, I don't know if this will work for you um, don't count on it you're cheap and you're doing poopy things and please support Notch and all he's doing with Minecraft, because that guy, he deserves it. That guy put so much time into this, and uh, he deserves the fame and the money he's uh, so duly earned. So now you're going to pop into Minecraft, and go ahead and log in, or do whatever you want. And so you should be here in Minecraft, and then I'm going to go ahead and push my key, which is F. And the top hand, or top left hand corner, I can't move my mouse, it moves my thing. Um, is flying. So, like I said, push E to fly. And you can go forward with W, A, S, D, back, left, right. Like I said, Q is down or hold shift. It makes you run faster. I have God mode on, so I don't have to worry about falling. If you don't have God mode on, please don't do that or you'll die. Um, you can hold left shift, like I said, so here's normal speed, fast speed, normal, fast. And it really does work. And uh, go ahead, guys, and you can change around the controls and stuff. Um, I don't have any of the other mods equipped right now, but go ahead, mess around with those. I'll do a tutorial on how to uh, use those in single player. I don't know if they all work on multiplayer. You'd have to contact your admin and ask if they do. I would personally like to thank you guys for watching this video. And if you have any ideas for any other videos, um, let me know, and I would gladly make a tutorial and uh, do my best to uh, find out how that works. All right, thanks for guy or watching, guys. <laughs> Please rate, comment, um, subscribe, and uh, thumbs up if you like it. Thumbs down if you don't. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.